Thrush is one of the common health problem, which occurs due to the development of yeast infection. The condition of oral thrush is also known as oropharyngeal candidiasis. The infection can grow in large amounts and can cause a lot of problems. Thrush is one of the common health problem, which occurs due to the development of yeast infection. The condition of oral thrush is also known as oropharyngeal candidiasis. The infection can grow in large amounts and can cause a lot of problems. Here, we have provided detailed information about the problem of oral thrush along with its causes as well as symptoms. Read on to know more about various effective ways to cure the problem of oral thrush effectively. What is thrush? Thrush in the mouth or the problem of oral thrush is caused due to the development of yeast infection, which occurs in your mouth along with your tongue. The problem is caused due to the problem of Candida albicans fungus. It should be noted that the bacteria of Candida albicans always reside on your tongue as very small quantities. However, when this fungus starts to grow uncontrollably, it can cause the problem of oral thrush. It has been found that most of the times the development of oral thrush can be done in toddlers as well as infants. Most common symptoms are the development of white bumps on the cheeks and tongue of the infants as well as toddlers. However, you can get rid of this growth as soon as the treatment is received. It should be noted that oral thrush has been considered as one of the common problems and does not cause any major complications usually. However, you may have a problem due to oral thrush if you are suffering from the immune system. What causes thrush uncontrolled growth of the fungus Candida albicans is the real problem behind the development of oral thrush. The good microorganisms in the mouth help in maintaining the balance between Candida albicans and bad microorganisms. However, when the balance is disrupted the harmful bacteria start to develop, which causes infection. Oral thrush may also take place due to a weakening of the immune system due to certain medications, which causes the reduction in the number of good microorganisms, which are helpful in preventing infection. Healthy cells can be eliminated due to cancer treatments such as radiation and chemotherapy. This put you at higher risk of various other infections such as oral thrush. Various diseases, which attacks the immune system such as AIDS, HIV as well as leukemia promotes the risk of oral thrush, another deadly disease which weakens the immune system and can cause the problem of oral thrush is diabetes. In diabetes, an extra amount of sugar is always present in saliva, which can play a key role in promoting the growth of the candida albicans. In newborn babies, the problem of oral thrush can grow at birth. It has been found that the same bacteria which can cause oral thrush can also promote the development of yeast infection. The newborn babies can get the problem during the delivery if the mother is suffering from vaginal yeast infection. What are thrush symptoms? Oral thrush does not cause any symptoms at the initial stage. However, as the infection of fungus starts to grow with time, some symptoms may start to erupt. These symptoms are as follows. Development of white bump on the tongue, gums, inner cheeks as well as tonsils. Bleeding from the bumps if they are scrapped, cracked as well as the dry skin, especially at the corners of the mouth. Difficulty in swallowing the major symptoms of oral thrush in infants are irritability, difficulty in feeding fussiness. Sometimes babies suffering from the oral thrush can pass the infection to their mothers while breastfeeding. Some of the major symptoms of fungus infection during breastfeeding are pain, itching as well as sensitivity around nipples, moderate to severe pain during breastfeeding, laking of skin around the nipple, piercing pain in breast. What does thrush look like? The patches, which appears due to the oral thrush, are of creamy or white in color, which can bleed slightly after wiping off the area. You might also experience swelling as well as redness of the area around your mouth lining. Other lesions may also appear at the same time, which is also linked to the problem of oral thrush. Due to oral candida, along with lesions, you may also face the problem of burning sensation in the affected areas. You may experience intense pain while doing normal activities such as eating or drinking. Other problems such as loss of taste as well as unpleasant taste in the mouth can also occur due to invasions of yeast in the mouth. Sometimes, white plaques may also take place in the mouth, although it may not be linked with pain and may appear in various other areas such as limbs, nails as well as scalp. How to get rid of oral thrush It should be kept in mind that age, as well as overall health, are the two main points on which the treatment of the oral thrush is dependent upon. The main aim of the treatment to prevent the spreading as well as the growth of the fungus. Some of the medical treatments, which can be used to prevent the problem of oral thrush includes, amphotericin B, for treating severe infections, clotrimazole, an antifungal medication, which you need to leave in your mouth until it gets dissolved in it. Fluconazole, it is an amazing oral antifungal medication. Nistatin, an effective antifungal mouthwash.
itraconazole, better antifungal medication, which is used for people especially suffering with AIDS and HIV. Some of the points which you should keep in mind while treating the problem of oral thrush can include replacing of toothbrushes until the infection eliminates brushing your teeth with the help of soft toothbrushes for rinsing your mouth, using natural remedies such as salt water mixture keeping control on the blood sugar levels, especially when you are suffering from diabetes. Consuming products with unsweetened flavor to reduce the quantity of sugar in the saliva. Avoid using chemical mouthwashes as well as sprays. For the breastfeeding mothers, the treatment includes use of nursing pads for stopping the prevention of fungus, applying antifungal medication on breast and on baby while breastfeeding, washing of all the breastfeeding items such as breast pump bottle nipples with an effective solution of water and vinegar and using them after air dry. How to prevent oral thrush Follow the major preventive tips which are listed here to prevent the problem of oral thrush. With the help of corticosteroid inhaler, rinse your mouth every day. Take care and treat the problem of vaginal yeast infection, especially when you are pregnant. Consume yogurt after consuming the prescribed antibiotics. Following proper and effective oral hygiene by flossing and brushing your teeth every day. This becomes even more important if you are suffering from diabetes. Disclaimer The above tips and information are only for reference purpose. The articles are not written by qualified Medicare professionals. Even though you may find the tips and information easy and useful, we recommend you to consult a qualified Medicare professional before adopting these. It is necessary to analyze and find out your physical fitness in accepting these tips. Some tips may not sweet you or you may be allergic to. Hence consulting a Medicare professional is essential. Failing which, you'll be having the sole responsibility for the consequences arising out of your negligence and reluctance. Note we inform you that we are not owner of any of the products, images or any other products displaying on our website. But all the articles are written by us and we own them. If you found any image or product that found under your copyrights then please feel free to contact us. We will remove that image or product as soon as possible. All the images are collected from Google. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to receive new video, new video.